What is going on CH family? My name is Caden Hayward. I'm the CEO of Coach Hayward. Today, what we're going to be talking about is the power of momentum. So, let me put this to you uh, in a visual way. Let's say there's a wall here and you take, a, you take your fist or you take a car or anything, a hammer, and you hit it once. Nothing happens. But what happens when you consistently hit it every single time over a long period of time? After enough time, with all this momentum constantly coming at it, eventually you're going to break through. So, this is a good analogy for the importance of momentum because when you're starting something, when you're starting to lose weight, for an example, and you know, you're, you're, just, you're, at the, you're at the starting line, okay? The gun goes off and you start your weight loss journey. You might be fired up at first, you might be motivated, you might be full of adrenaline, etc., but the second that you, you know, start getting some laps in or, you know, a few weeks go by, uh, maybe even a week after of dieting, of trying to go to the gym and work out and follow these new habits and this new lifestyle, what's going to happen is that you're going to be frustrated. You're going to lose that momentum and that drive really, really quickly, okay? This is probably why you've maybe lost weight two weeks after January and gained it back in February. So how do we build momentum so we can continue forward um, and not fall off the seat anymore, not fall off the wagon anymore and go back to our old ways? Well, guys, number one is to consistently do something that's focused towards your goals every single day. That's right. You want to be completely in to your goals. You want to always be focused on them. You always want to be thinking about them and always have reminders for them too. That being said, you can have affirmations when you're, it's on your driving seat. Uh, have affirmations in your, in your uh, mirror when you look in the mirror every day. Write down your journal what you want to do. Write down your goals every single day, three times, etc. every night as well. Uh, all of these things you can do to always remind yourself or buy a fitness watch and have a picture, the background of your goal body or your phone ba background as your goal body. I do this with my clients. All these things are going to help remind you of this goal and keep that momentum forward so you're always going to take whatever action you do in your day-to-day -day life is going to be focused towards that goal. So that being said, uh, you know, in order to keep this momentum going, what we need to do is we need to take little steps day by day that are going to help us get closer to that goal. So then eventually you've got these steps going consistently where you can start to add on more and more and more and more tasks and habits and slowly build them to the point where it's almost automatic to you. And that's why we call it, you know, that's why we say building the habit is one of the most important things to losing weight and keeping off for life. So once you get that momentum going, it's so easy now because you're in that flow state. You're, if you know what I'm talking about, if you've ever been there, it's amazing. It's an amazing state to be in. And the last thing you want to do is get out of that state. Okay. So do something consistently every single day. Now that being said, if you guys are in this flow state, like, and you usually drink, cut back on the drinking for a bit, cut back on the, like watching TV, keep yourself going in this momentum, take advantage of this momentum and this drive that you have going. Okay. Now the thing here guys is what you want to do is always also set uh, go little goals along the way so you can get this little bit of confidence and uh, help your self, self esteem, etc. So you can keep going and want to set more and more and more goals. Okay. Because what's going to happen is eventually you are going to fall off the wagon and uh, if you don't have the discipline, if you don't have the habits in place, then it's really hard to get that momentum going again. Alrighty guys, so that's a quick video on the importance of momentum. If you like this, uh, if you feel like this is going to help you on your weight loss journey, just leave some love below, uh, even comment a heart if you want to. But that being said, uh, I hope you all, I wish you all the best on your weight loss journey and I'll see you next time.